Hi everyone! Yay! <laughs> oh, it's been a while, but I'm back! Ready to do another piece of artwork for you guys. Um, a lot's been happening, but um, it's all working out. It's all it's all doing good. Um, yeah, so um, ready to do some some more artwork for you guys, and let's get started.
that drawing, which actually went quite faster than last time, <laughs> because I chose to use markers, um, they take less time. They're much faster medium to use. So um, I just thought to try it this time compared to last time when I did uh, color pencils. So um, here we have. Here's the drawing that you saw. Now I look at it, that dolphin looks really long. <laughs> now I'm being all critiquey and stuff, but I'm gonna try not to, that's not the goal of these, uh, I guess, exercises in a way. Um, uh, just a few things, technical thing to let you know, this part right here was supposed to be a shadow of this, but then I thought about, you know, technical stuff, little mess up, that's what happens when you work with markers and stuff you can't erase. Oh well. But, um, as you could probably know already what this is, it's a dolphin, um, and jumping out of the water, and where to start? Well, actually, I thought it was going to be a pink dolphin, as you could see, but I used it more as, um, as a shadow, so, and didn't fill in anything else because I didn't have a lighter marker of pink that I felt like would work best, um, but as I kept looking at it, it's like, wait a minute, it could be a white dolphin too. Um, so, um, yeah, I just, Ooh, excuse me, <laughs> body does what it does. Um, and so I wrote a couple of notes here. So, um, a dolphin actually represents helpful and supportive people or, um, friends and, um, that usually create perfect harmony um, within the friendship, uh, the relationship, um, and there's unity. Um, so that's what the dolphin represents. And also keep in mind, um, to, to keep in mind, um, water symbolizes the Holy Spirit. Um, so the idea of the dolphin jumping in and out and living in the water is could be a symbol of um, their spiritual walk. So these supportive people are people of faith and um, that come alongside you. Um, I think, honestly, I think this is a lot for me. <laughs> this artwork is, is, was meant for me as well. Um, just where I'm at in my life right now. Um, Finding the need to have supportive people surrounded by supportive and helpful people that are very loving and also are of the same faith. And so I feel like, yeah, this really speaks to me a lot. Um, looking at my notes here. Um, it, you can look at either way. You can look at it as a pink dolphin because of the pink. Or if you look at it white, the, the color meanings are actually really positive. For pink, it represents innocence. It could also represents purity, um, not just being white. White is usually known as purity, um, but pink could also be, and also childlike um, with the innocence, uh, childlike faith um, that they have for, um, that it is spoken of in Christian faith to have a childlike faith. Um, um, if you have any questions on that, go ahead and comment. Well, we can discuss that like, um, in another time, but, um, if you were looking at the dolphin as white, um, that symbolizes um, actually the spirit of the Lord, because the spirit, the um, Lord being God, God is perfect, God is pure, um, God is light, holy power. So um, one one thing that popped in my head is also a meaning um, for white could be victory. Um, that really resonated to, to me um, a lot as well, that encompassing everything um, in a nutshell, <laughs> processing. Um, there have been those or those who are coming along, are coming alongside you that will be helpful and supportive in your walk, life, could just everyday life, 
to your spiritual walk, um, wherever you're at, just people that you can count on and, like I said, being supportive to you. Um, and yeah, they're either establishing, you're already getting to know people, or people are yet to come um, to be in your life for that. To create harmony, to create unity, things that I feel like every person needs to have in their life. Um, that healthy and fruitful and living and growing kind of relationship with others. Um, yeah, uh, I think that sums it up. Um, so yeah, that's uh, maybe because maybe because it's one dolphin, it could be one individual. That a new person that's coming into your life or a person um, usually in the in the past when I've seen dolphins um, in dreams I've seen more than one but in this case I saw I just saw one so it could be an individual um, so be prepared for that um, that blessing of that person in your life and don't take them for granted um, anything else I think that's it yeah so that's that's the message for today on what I feel like God has wanted to share with you guys and share with me um I feel good right now. Do you feel good right now? I hope so. I hope you feel good right now and feel empowered and encouraged um, that God is looking out for you. He's He wants He is there. He's already there for you and on your side is just he just would like to be more included in your life if if he isn't in your included in your life right now um so maybe that's the supportive helpful pr person is um in christian faith um the holy trinity um each individual is con is seen as a person as an individual as a being um, so I think even God is a, is a person that has, that can interact with you, can work with you. He has so many names and one of them is counselor. Um, if you're going through anything right now, he could, he's, he's there to listen. And I know for me personally, if, if that's the case for you, um, just journal journal and write your thoughts down and and then pray and include him in in uh your thought process and he gets he i've had it and from my own experience when i journal life god speaks to me as i write my thoughts down like it's like almost a conversation like almost um instant messenger <laughs> um in a way that i get a, i get a quick response a lot of times um when I'm struggling with something and I just need a vent and stuff like that right down. Um, so yeah, um, if I hope this artwork and this message um, resonates with you. Um, I'm sorry, I keep looking at myself and not the camera, not at this or at you, so know that I'm looking at you. <laughs> um, I just, I think I'm overthinking. Let's just pray. <laughs> okay. Lord, thank you so much for this time. And that I, that you want to use my gifts and my talents, Lord, to share your love with the world. Sharing, give a light to those who do not know you or maybe have heard of you but do not know you well about you and your son Jesus Christ that 
the message that is constantly repeated in your word is love. You're, you are love, God. You are love. You represent love. You are the you encompass what love is and that has so many layers and dimensions that it's beautifully complicated what love is and there was there is no room for pain and suffering that is not of you at all because you are love and for some people that might be hard to believe because from what they've come to learn who you are from uh, other believers interpretation of who you are and who your your son Jesus is is painted differently I pray that this video opens if not a door but a window into a whole new light um, revealing your true nature to them. I pray that you be with those that are watching this video right now. That you give, you bless them, Lord, bless them, and let them know that all any goodness that comes their way is from you, Lord. Thank you, Lord, so much for loving us first, and you taught us. I see us. <laughs> I do meet me, but I'm in habit of praying for with more people um other people other believers um thank you for teaching me um what love is it was love that changed my life it was your love that changed my life lord and i know that would be the key for other people's lives as well so i pray that they experience your love experience your light and experience your freedom in Jesus' name, amen. Thank you again so much for um, watching this video. Um, I'm going to do my best to um, make some more <laughs> um, and not have so much big gaps in between each video. I'm going to do my best. And uh, stay tuned. And if you like this video, please like. Push the like button. And... Um, I would love it if you subscribe and, so, and also click the little bell so you know um, when the next video comes up. And yeah, God bless you. And not you sneezing, God bless you. <laughs> I don't know why I thought that. I think it was just the way I said it. Um, um, may God bless you. <laughs> um, and I will see you soon. Bye.